everyone welcome back to my channel so in today's video we are going to be drawing this bird and also making it into a sticker and if you would like to see how I drew that blue bird I showed in the beginning I will have that video linked down below but the first thing I do is find a reference photo I am currently working on creating a spring floral bird bundle so I found this reference of this blue winged leaf bird and I thought it was really cute and colorful and perfect for spring and summer so I start off with a quick sketch and then I go ahead and start adding the base colors underneath the sketch You'll see throughout this video that I am clicking on the reference photo. Whenever you have a reference pulled up in Procreate, you can color pick straight from that photo so that way you're getting accurate colors. So basically I just go back and forth from color picking and then I will add the feather details, shadows, highlights, and I'll also add some little flowers. So I'm going to go ahead and let this video play and then I will come back once I'm ready to turn it into a sticker.
All right, it is time to print. I am printing this sticker on glossy sticker paper. I take one of my laminating pouches and I line it up within the registration line and then trim the edges. So this is why I always print two separate sticker sheets because this pouch you can peel apart and then you have one for each set of stickers. Because these pouches are thermal, I can then go in and adjust where they're at just to make sure it's lined up and completely within the registration lines. Then I run it through my laminator on hot. Whenever I'm running it through, I try to hold the other side pretty straight. Otherwise, because the paper is getting heated up, um, they are more prone to curl. So I just try and keep it straight when it's coming out. Then I take some matte scotch tape and cover the registration lines. Then I take a black Sharpie and go over the lines again. I did recently film a whole video on some steps that you can do if your Cricut is not reading your glossy paper. I will have that video linked down below. Now I'm going to run it through my cutting machine and make the sticker. And that's it. That is how I draw and make my stickers. I am pretty happy how this bird turned out and I'm going to be adding it to a bird bundle. So I would love to know what bird and flowers that you guys would like to see next. If you ever follow any of my tutorials, don't forget to tag me over on Instagram and I will see you in my next YouTube video.